guys um uh, welcome back to another weekly vlog this is me way in the future editing but we're back with a vlog and i'm very excited to get back into editing vlogs and i feel like this is a good one but it is very chaotic and a little bit all over the place just because as you'll see quite early on in the video things kind of went to shit <laughs> but as quickly as we fell down we picked it back up and started to have our usual great fun crazy times and i actually think you're all gonna love this vlog what the hell let's get into it cool yeah <laughs> I know you can't hear this. I go for a walk. Oh, 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 oh. Baby, give me a lo 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 wo 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 wo. Give me a lo wo 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 wo. I fully just had to cut that walk short because I thought my uterus was gonna fall out of my asshole. So I had to come home. Hey! I'm vlogging! Hey. Oh my god, you're vlogging! Stop it right now! I am <laughs> an actor <laughs> and I Okay, here we go! This is where everything went wrong and I just felt like every aspect of my life was falling to pieces obviously i was being dramatic it was only a couple of days later i then decided to get my act together get working get cleaning and then make myself look good and you know what cures everything a hickory chicken in a basket <laughs> It's 5 p.m. There was no point in filming in work. Had a busy day, but today is a very important day. And no, it's not because I just took off my like yeah. three-month-old toenail varnish. And no, it's not because I just handed in the final pieces of paperwork to finalize my house. It's none of that. It's because it's pancake day. I'm just patiently waiting for my family to come home so we can make pancakes. So I'm just gonna sit in my room like this until they arrive. I'm gonna get changed first. Maybe I'll wait downstairs by the window and see if they get here any quicker. Here. <laughs> well, you do the lazy version, but it's actually not that lazy because you've got to shake it for like one hour. <laughs> How are you doing? Nice. <laughs> 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 yeah and I'm eating my lunch we have super noodles today and that's all I have with me <gasps> do you know what I have do you know what I have yeah so nutritious but I just thought I'd pop in and say hello because not much interesting things have happened anyway I'm gonna eat this and continue watching drag weight 
drag wigs. You literally just with it. I decided it was time to leave. Luckily, I was a nerd and got a scholarship to come to. Guess who's just been to the gym? And I just made it's bloody delicious banana protein milkshake. So it's banana protein with water, a dollop of ice cream, and a dollop of peanut butter. It tastes delicious. Balance. Hey guys, I've left work early because I'm picking up a dishwasher. I didn't realize it had sauce on it, but I just got this deli meat feast sub thing from Tesco. I did have a jack potato tuna and cheese and veg for lunch which is so much healthier but now I'm just going to use the cheese that I had and put that on my deli sub. These subs are so good they literally taste like Subway. The rest of my meal deal I got some pomegranate and a bottle of water. I'm home. All errands are done. And there's a parcel. First up, I'm seeing this on TikTok shop um, for like 26 pound, which I thought was like a pretty good deal, but there was 20% off on ASOS and I had a voucher. So there's these three things, I think I only ended up paying 20 pounds. I am so excited. This is fucking tiny, first of all. I understand. Oh, that's really nice. Then the Bum Bum Queen, again, this is really small. Like this stuff is so expensive. So I'm glad that that smells really good because it makes it worth it. Oh, they're actually not what I expected. I didn't read the description like, yeah, I love. Then this is the Moisturizing Shower Cream Gel. This is the biggest part out of all of them. This is the one that I care about the least, to be honest. Ooh. I love. We got a little baby tea. Baby teas don't suit me because of my boobs. But I saw this one and I was like, I just have to try it. And it's this weekend collective one. Size six. The only thing I'm worried about is with my boobs is if this is gonna like stretch so much that it cracks. I think it's gonna. And the second thing, it's tiny. It's just a little like play suity thing. A little romper. A romper moment? Should we try them on? I really can't be asked. Okay, let's try them on. Don't have a bra on, so I need to retry this on with a bra. I can't be asked to put a bra on right now. I think it's possibly nice. I just love the shape of it. It's just the shoulders that never really suit me. I just feel like they'd make me look wide. I think I love this, but I just think is it too low on my boobs. Oh, I don't know. I want to keep it. I don't know. What do we think? Help. What's up, bitches? I've just been for a lash lift. But I'm going for a meal this evening. Uh, I can't now any makeup in my eyes. My meal's booked at seven. It's like five-ish now, and I can't stop thinking about food. I'm literally not even hungry. Maybe I should go to the shops to distract myself. I don't know which is worse, spending money or eating. Connor said that he's arranged a little date night tomorrow. So I'm excited for tomorrow. I gave in to food and you would think, cause I'm fully aware that I shouldn't be eating right now, that I would at least pick something healthy. But no, I opted for a pancake with Nutella. I'm not even hungry. Okay, we are ready to go. my hair I went for a cheeky little look in TK Maxx and found this vase and it was only six pound what the hell I had a salad for lunch and then I started cleaning oh my mugs arrived my mugs arrived for the new house but basically how I clean is I saw all of my stuff into piles to make it easier for me to put them away then I decided to redo all of my drawers and make them all tidy again uh except 
this one. We don't look at that one. Um, then I made the bed. Obviously, it had to go around Milo. Like, how dare I move him ever? I had a little dance bed is made then i had to make some work phone calls and like pay off some invoices i jumped in the shower used my new sol de janeiro and got ready to go that meal was 10 out of 10 it was stunning i'm so full though coconut rum and also this glass is looking very stealable Connor makes me drink water and he said we're not allowed to leave the gym until I finish he even locked the windows to make sure I don't pour out the window ugh alright we're going to the gym Connor's, Connor's cooked me a gourmet meal while we watch Drive to Survive Chef Connor in the building. It's time to say they said this was going to start at half nine. I don't even know why I care so much to watch it, but I do. <laughs> oh, get everyone out. I feel a bit nervous. <laughs> oh, get off him. Ooh. Nice oh, that was a good him. dodge. He's wiping his beard sweat on him. He's up. <laughs> oh! Good night. Good morning. Toasted bagel. Philadelphia. And let's put the cucumber on. I honestly look such a state today. I feel like it should be unacceptable to wear these headbands unless you have makeup on. I'm gonna eat this while listening to the useless hotline and crack on with some work. Guys, I think I'm getting ill. This is just not good. This is not good. I'm finding it really hard to concentrate today. I feel like I've got so much to do. Like, there's so much in my head. And I just I'm finding it hard to do any of it because there's so much in here. I actually just shouldn't have done this. I already regret it, but... I'm currently in the McDonald's drive through Currently stopped in the middle of the road, but no regrets. <laughs> There's a car coming. Bye, sorry. <laughs> I can't decide whether to go and return my parcels. I think I should just go and do it. I might be late for my little sister. Yeah, I'm gonna return them after. I'm actually going to stand like an actual outside of my sister's school and wait for her to hand me a bagel. The pizza bagels are my old school. Incredible, and I've not stopped thinking about them since I left school. And she's just gonna pass it through the through the fence. I'm gonna take my parcels after and I'm gonna meet my Nana for a little cup of coffee. Mum pulled up outside. So she's driving me 30 seconds around the corner to make me look like less of a There you go. I had to drive because she felt like Thank you. Mm. Just how I remember. Drinking a cake with my nana was super cute. Picked up a parcel that was waiting for me and returned another one. Then I went for a laser. Yes, I will be bringing you a video on this. Then went for a coffee with Lucy. Coffee girls. Local tea cake at the local. What you looking at? Do you not think that's quite scary? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hi, 
Hey everybody, it's been a stressful morning because we're going to our baby shower and uh, I was prepped and ready with my outfits because I know that I would have a meltdown if I wasn't. But then the girls decided last minute that they're gonna change the vibe completely. So I had a meltdown. This is the aftermath. Ooh! I cried my makeup off. I think I've fixed it now, but this is what we're wearing. Oh, yeah. So nice. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, yeah. <laughs> For fuck's sake, I was trying to be nice. <laughs> Perfect hangover cure is going to the pancake house and having a banana and syrup, I think, pancake. Walked around and seen all the fishies and then what the fuck are these googly eyes on a rock for 50p. Fed the ducks, had a walk and then listened to the weirdo goose. Geese? I don't know. <laughs> You're gonna call them fancy animals. Look at that show. <laughs> <laughs> You're weird. Yeah, you are weird. I hate it so much. <laughs> hey guys, I'm eating lunch for breakfast. I'm also in a mood today. I think I'm due on my period. I don't know whether it's because I get up so early that I then start to crave at lunch. I don't know. I don't know. Does it really make a difference which I eat first? It's all going into the same place. Does it matter what time? Happy birthday <laughs> to you. Well, hello vlog. Oh, I don't know about this chicken. Does that look a bit pink? Or is it just breadcrumbs? I don't know. I think it's okay, but because I'm like burning the outside. That looks pink, doesn't it? Does that look pink? Surely it's not because it's dry as fog because I've cooked it so much. I think that must be fine. It's been in for 20 minutes. Is that cooked? See, like, that's definitely cooked. It's been in for so long, though. How could it not be cooked? Shall I ask the girls? I think I'm going to put it back in. We're off to Budapest. Also, look at that makeup free patch because I've been like this. I'm gonna check on this chicken. Oh my god, they are like burnt. Oh. Fuck off. Yesterday, Lucy took me for a coffee. She was like, oh yes, we have our PT tomorrow. And I was like, sorry, what? What the fuck do you mean we have a PT? Oh my god. Hey friends! <laughs> We're in the gym with Han. Hey! Hi. And we're doing an upper today. <laughs> Go. Oh, <sorry>. <laughs> <laughs> One. Now it's time for breakfast. Well, brunch. I'm in a great mood today. Bagel. Toasted bagel. I need a wing. Philadelphia. Garlic and herb. Does anyone ever pick which side's going to be better? I think the top side's going to be better. And then I make sure like I add like the better egg onto that side. Anyone else? No. And then some chives. 
I just went for a quick wee on my way upstairs. And I've come on my period. But how lucky is that that I didn't start while I was in the gym? I make things look really nice and then I don't even eat the whites or the eggs. And it doesn't taste that bad, but I just empty the yolk onto the bagel. Okay, I've had a shower, a little bit of a chill, done some emails, and now I need to go to the solicitors and my mum and that are away this weekend and her car's in the garage so I'm gonna go pick that up. So, Milo, do you wanna go? Do you wanna, do you wanna go for walkies? Let's go. Milo Moo, Milo! I genuinely can't be trusted alone for more than five minutes because I've just gone and bought something that I genuinely shouldn't be buying. I'm going to pick it up now. <laughs> me going silent as if you can't still hear me. I love them. I wanted the AirPod Maxes for like forever, but why the fuck does everybody have them and they're 670 pound? Like that is ridiculous for a pair of headphones. Like why does everyone have them? Why are they so normal to have? So I've been looking for a pair of nice headphones. I really like the Sony ones, but I just wanted something a little bit different. And then these came along. I love the Marshalls like aesthetic, like I love it. And they are so light and these little crushing things, I want to buy it so bad. Me and Erin are having a little Galentine's and we have a little, well, it's just like one of the Marks and Spencer's cans, but it's a raspberry mojito. Delicious. And then wait until you see this, guys. Look at what we've got. Look, it's a mini cheese board. So we're having this as our starter. Yay. I forgot to film the main course, but we have a lemon tart. Oh, look at the state of me. Scrambled egg with truffle honey mm. on a bagel. My like little stand for my camera is literally over there, but I'm too lazy to go get it. So you're balancing on my Starbucks cup. A few things to update you on while I turn my Lumi lamp on. Number one, I am dying from the gym. I can barely walk. I'm absolutely aching, but I thoroughly enjoyed it. So that's number one. Number two, last night, so I waxed my upper lip a few days ago, ready for this weekend. And then I realised the next day that I did a really shit job. Last night, I was like, oh, I'm just going to re-wax it. Fucking rips like my skin off on my upper lip. Can you see that? Mm. And then finally, I have an order from Look Fantastic. First step, I got some more moisturiser. Then, oh my God, is this the wrong colour? I think this is the wrong colour. Maybe it's not. I got this concealer because I like this one. And with all the discounts, it was like three pounds. And I was like, sick. Then I got this stuff. I bloody love this. I actually didn't realize the size I got of this. It's a super smoothing cream for silky and shiny hair. And I don't care what it does, but it smells fucking amazing. Finally, this is a new product I've never used before. On the like Kardashians, one of the Kardashian episodes, Chris Appleton was doing Kim's hair and someone noticed that he was using this on her. It's the Bedhead Queen for a Day Thickening Spray for insane volume and texture good for a bouncy blowout that is everything i got i have no plans for the evening hey it's wednesday and i feel shit i feel shit there's something wrong with my fucking skin and it's pissing me off i've not been wearing makeup to help it i did a face mask last night i'm doing my skincare and then the camera's just not gonna show it up but all under my eyes, it's just like, it's kind of like dry skin, but it's not dry. All on my chin, all here, on my nose, here. I mean, we have an explanation for the upper lip, but still, and I don't know what's wrong with it. I'm hungry 24 seven. I'm being so lazy. Every time I get started on work, I end up on my phone, like I do one tiny thing, like I click a button and then I'm like, I'm gonna reward myself with TikTok. And I was going somewhere with that. Oh my God. 
can't remember why. All I brought today was toast for breakfast. So I had that with lemon curd on it, which is delicious by the way. Then I bought a fruit and yogurt. I've eaten that. And then I bought this Nutella bar. And I know that's not... I don't know. I have no concept of how much food is normal. But I've eaten all that and it's quarter to one. I'm not even hungry, but I just want to eat. So I'm stressing myself out. So I'm going to write a little to-do list of things I want to get done before I leave. There's literally like three things, but I feel like if I tick them off, then I'll do them. Do you know what I mean? My quote of the day is going to be, stop procrastinating. Number one, I need to scan and email these documents. Number two, I need to print, complete, scan, and send a visibility assessment. And then finally, I need to file all these risk assessments. So I need to do all that. The only thing I can think about is driving to McDonald's and buying the chips. I've actually had a really productive day. I did all the things that I need to do and so much more. I'm going to reward myself with a McDonald's. Is that a spot coming? That's the last thing I need. Anyway, it's half four. I've worked late and I'm going to go home. Good morning vlog. The past few days have been a bit shit in terms of vlogging. Just because I've obviously been in a mood. I also realised today when I took my temperature that I am due on my period. So that kind of explains everything this week. I actually feel good about today. I've had a nice chilled morning doing some work on my laptop. And now it's 10am and I'm getting ready. I'm getting my nails done later. What I was so excited about because I snapped this one for Budapest. There are a few like bits that I want to get. So I did do some online shopping, but then my mum has agreed to let my little sister have the day off school because it was her birthday last week and we were supposed to go on the weekend, but then obviously my granddad died. So I'm going to take her shopping to Liverpool tomorrow. So I just did not need to buy the things that I bought on ASOS, but... for a drink and he's on a work call in the car and he's making me stand outside. <laughs> Go away! Look what I did to my nail. Oh, <laughs> my fucking nails! Get up! Now? Now. Oh! <laughs> Do you not want to come for a drink? Oh, I need Botox. I, I need Botox. Should we get Botox? What? Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> kind of slay. Now doing hair up. <laughs> it actually feels so good. Oh. <laughs> 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 Morning, friends. We are in Liverpool. We just drove here. I'm actually really fucking ill. Um, but we're just going to pretend that that's not a thing. We're at right back, guys. Lydia got a chocolate milkshake. And a burger. I got a grilled cheese, if you know, you know. 10 out of 10, every time. Do we reckon I can balance you on this glass? That's not looking great, is it? Maybe if I just slouch. Yeah. I'm back from Liverpool and I'm ill. I'm so unorganised for this bloody holiday. My room is a mess. I feel like I somehow need to tidy that and start packing before anyone gets here. That's just not going to happen really, is it? But let's give you a little haul. First up is some like fluffy socks because I got fake Uggs because uh, I'm not paying for real ones. because There's just no way. £3.50 from Primark. They're cute and I think they will look 
good with my thugs from H&M. I was emin and iron about this. Remember when I said that I did a bit of online shopping and I shouldn't have done that? I bought, I just wanted some black trousers. So I ordered like four black pants. Where am I going with that? I need a wee. They were supposed to arrive today and they haven't come. So it's bloody lucky I got these because I wasn't going to because I was like, oh, well, I've ordered them. But these were cheaper than any of the ones I've ordered. I think they were 14 99 So they were like 15 quid. And also I accidentally took an extra small to the dressing room. I'm obviously not an extra small, but I thought that I'd got a small and I thought, God, that's a little bit like, you know, that's wishful thinking. So then I came out and I couldn't be asked going back in to try on the medium so i just tried them on like in the middle of the shop over my flares and the medium was huge and i was like what has happened here and yeah basically they are small but it's because the back is like slightly there's not much stretch but there's stretch in the back and they just fit amazing black trousers like loose trousers but they look really nice on i'm really happy with them can anyone tell me why Batiste dry shampoo has gone up to like four pounds for one bottle? Like that's just obscene. So I'm gonna try out the super drug one. So I got one that's a volumizing dry shampoo and one's just coconut. And it was two for four pounds. You get two for the price of one Batiste, and I was like, well, that's a no-brainer, isn't it? Why do I keep dropping everything? I love this. I shouldn't have got it. There's no ounce of me that needed another dry shampoo. Why do I look like I'm in an interview? Why haven't I taken my coat off? Anyway, and this is a large, it's super oversized. It's so oversized. I just loved it. It's just this crew neck. And the colour's not showing very well. It's this like light, like warm brown. And I got the matching joggers. Just your standard joggers. I'm really happy with that because, cars thinking for the airport this fluffy bucket hat so i thought i could wear them so i was packing my hat and then these sunglasses what is that yeah cool yeah oh i also got a lip liner cans and they're by nyx the shade mauve then last but not least this shirt from pull and bear as well i got a large and it's just like this really really thin one and i just love it like the material of this is so soft i'm obsessed right what time is it it's 10 to 6 already oh my god i won't bore you with showing you what i'm doing but i'm gonna tidy this wish me luck the room is tidy and it's seven minutes past six so that is great going cooking pizza and quesadillas holiday mode i mean these two are not in holiday mode chin chin mm. it's like juice yeah and strings and ceiling wax and other fancy stuff. Oh, I'm good, you know. The magic dragon. Good morning. I listen. Good morning. We're going on holiday. Oh, grow up. You grow up. That's so poor. This is what Ebony has to work with today. It's so disgusting. <laughs> so good <laughs> hello i'm back for my blow dry which you can't see but it was 10 out of 10 but i quickly put in some rollers to make sure it holds because it's friday again. and now i need to pack because we're leaving at one well actually we need to leave at quarter to one because we need to get to lucy and george's for one and it's half 11 and i've not started packing so i'm gonna do that now and i'm not gonna vlog it because otherwise it's just gonna yeah, so let me. Okay, so made it in time. All good, kind of looking gorgeous. My hair is flicky as fuck. And that's where I'm gonna end this video and start the Budapest vlog. So like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.